TV and gang, welcome back, welcome back. So today's a bit of a rush one. As you can tell, I'm already dressed. We are about to head off and go to the SUR. I believe it's the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills or something like that. It's their restaurant, something the Cole wants to do. So we're gonna go there first. From there, we're probably gonna research a bit. We're probably gonna have to find out where all the stars live. So we wanna do a celebrity home tour. I don't, I don't wanna go on one of those buses because I know I've read reviews and those celebrity buses they drive past them, but they don't really see celebrities. I am more interested in going at my own pace, seeing the homes and not having to rush between the three. But we'll see how we go. So we'll go to the restaurant first and then we'll go from there. As I was getting changed, I realized that these are all different jeans to the ones I bought. So I have to go back. I have to go back and exchange them all. Well, not the ones I'm wearing currently, but these ones. That I just I just don't look good in them and I don't want to be that guy that is wearing jeans that I hate so refunds boom <laughs> This is all from Vegas all from Vegas. Wow Jesus, so we're trying to rush to find car parks, and I have no idea how to use this shit Rate per hour two dollars Two dollars per hour and how much do I have here like 20 cents? So I just gave this Porsche next to me another 48 minutes. Um, I didn't realize that it actually has numbers on them. It's my bad, it's my bad. But there's a lot of nice things around here, a lot of nice cars. I love nice cars and there is cars everywhere. So we're gonna check out this place. Obviously we're going in for brunch. So we had to book a fair while in advance, I believe. I think this place is very popular. So we had to book it in advance. I want to check it out. Apparently their goat cheese balls are crazy. So let's go nuts for some balls, I guess. Hi. Excited? people are but Nicole is starstruck so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna let her have a moment I'm just gonna chill here and I'm gonna eat some balls this is what I'm here for boys hmm? that's what I'm here for the balls <laughs> the balls look at all this food oh my god she's found the way to my heart through cheese balls but we thought we'd thought we'd splurge a little bit obviously I wanna I want to give this a go. I'm just gonna, just gonna pinch this. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my. So we just finished up at Sir. I think it's. Is that how you pronounce it, Sir? Sir. Really nice place, really nice. Um, I think we spent a lot of money, but it was worth it. Really good food. The balls were the best. I don't think you'll ever hear me say that again, but it was really nice. So basically from here, we're gonna go, gonna go home and then essentially just get changed and whatnot. And we have to sort of build the list of who we're going to see next. And then from there, we'll probably go through Malibu and then go through all the homes. So we're just heading back to the apartment now. Got to charge this thing because we don't have this thing, we don't have Wi-Fi, we don't have any sense of direction. I mean, I don't know how people functioned without phones before. So just uploading the first day of Vegas. I've uh, taken a bit of time, but it's got to be done. So I'm doing this while we get ready to go out and look at the homes. But I still have to make a list of the people that I actually want to see. I have to research where they live and all that type of stuff. So once I've done that, we'll be on our way. A bit of a change of plans. We just got dressed, obviously, as you can see, but we're not gonna go to celebrity homes, I don't think, because everything's a gated community, so we're gonna, we're gonna go to Vanderpump Dogs. Uh, I believe that's another franchise by them, so we're gonna go there first, pick up some stuff for the dogs. Obviously, we don't have dogs ourselves, but we know a lot of people that do have dogs, so we're gonna see what we can pick up there. Maybe some Louis Vuitton, you know what I'm saying, but we'll go there first, 
after that we'll go to Malibu and then yeah from there we'll probably try and get even more Instagram famous than I already am at like all the walls and all the graffiti art that's around the place because there's a lot of there's a lot of places like that here so we're gonna go there and yeah we'll, we'll go from there I, I don't know what we'll do after that but we'll see how we go so there's another Lamborghini Urus I've seen two I, think I saw the first one as I was driving past but I've never seen a Urus before really nice car I want to drive one <laughs> but obviously I can't um, yeah I want to spend more money on other stuff obviously if I if I had unlimited funds I'd obviously I'd obviously pay for one but it is what it is I can't tell I'm just letting this guy go but grab us G-Wagon oh that's so nice oh my god never see these never see these in Australia in comparison to here but every street I drive past there's at least one G-Wagon on every street it's this place is my dream. So just rocked up to the Vanderpump Dogs, just parked a little bit further away. I just did a reverse parallel very terribly because, let's be real here, I don't really wanna drive on the wrong side of the road, in the car, on the wrong side of the car, and fuck it up because I know I will. So I'm gonna be a good Samaritan and just give these guys a lot of space, including this guy that has about 50,000 stickers on his Prius, but. We're gonna head to Vanderbump Dogs. I saw the building, it's very hard to miss. It's like a big pink building, but I love dogs, so. There's a dog part, uh, dog playpen, sorry, in the actual store as well, which is pretty cool. So I might check that out, and yeah. So, first time parking on the streets. Don't know what it's gonna be like, I mean, surely it'll be okay. I don't think there's gonna be a problem, but I always see signs saying, take your shit, get it out of the cars, but it's all right, it's okay. Look at this place. Oh my god, Hud, you could have missed this. You could have missed this. Yeah, let's go. Yes, we need to use hand sanitizer more. Look at the clothes. <laughs> These are all dog clothes. These are not children's clothes. I repeat, they are not children's clothes. They're the cutest things I've ever seen. Surely this is like Chihuahua territory. Look at that. <laughs> it's got a little tie. It's got a bow tie. It's got a little bow tie. Wow. But that's for the girls. This is for the boys. He's still got the bow ties. And then diamond. There. Oh my gosh. Swaggy Chihuahua territory right now. Do I want a bomber jacket or does does my three month old? German Shepherd, maybe at two oh. months. Oh, two I don't months? think I'll fit a German Shepherd, but at two months, we can try. We can try and fit it on. <laughs> the best part of these things is the name Sniffany and Co. What else is there? I have to go. I have to go over here. Oh. Starbucks. Talk to people. <laughs> Seven pup. The puns are real in this place. The puns are definitely real. Look at that. Chewy Vuitton, Coco, Chunel, France. <laughs> I told you the puns are real. Yeah, this is the sixth one right here. Yeah, So sleepy. Oh, hello. Hello. Hi. <laughs> oh, hello. Hi. This one's so cute. I want them. I want them. Unfortunately, can't hold any of the dogs here. I wanted to so badly. There's some really cute ones, but and only unless you're adopting them. I don't want to stress them out too much. Obviously, they've been through a lot, so they are all rescue dogs as well. So really cool, really cool store. That's the black card. <laughs> Porter. <laughs> oh, too many puns. Not enough footage. I want him. I want him so bad. Fat lady to a lady with a lot of ass. Shit. So just finished up at Van Vanderpump Dogs. Took a few photos to uh, put on the IG, but nothing too major. Now we're going to go to, for a drive through Malibu. I have a feeling we're going to go to Rodeo, Rodeo, Rodeo Drive as well, just to check that out. But oh, I say it, I've said it like 400 times. This place is amazing. This place is awesome. Very glad I came to America. I was gonna, I think we were gonna decide to go to Europe instead. Obviously, I wanna go to Europe at some point, vlog that as well. But for the time being, I'm happy with America. America's amazing, everything's awesome. 
and having so much fun. We are literally point one of a mile, mile, before we get into Rodale. I think it's just here. Yeah, it's just here. And I expect to hear an orchestra. There's a Bentley right there. I expect to hear everything. Check this out, oh my god, this place is madness. There's a lot of walls, a lot of Instagram worthy shots. Oh man, there's a Ferrari just up here, Port Pino. I should probably be in this lane, but now there's a fire truck right next to me. Oh man. Probably gonna have to do a couple of laps, but Hope to see some good stuff. Hope to see some awesome stuff. Oh my god, there's a Rolls Royce SUV in front of this car. If this Honda Civic gets out of the way. Oh my god, I've never seen one. Oh, you hear that? Oh no. Rolls Royce SUV in front of me, but I can't see it. There's a wrapped M5 over there. I need to get in this lane so badly. This guy's taking way too long. He's doing more of the scenic route, you know what I'm saying? I'm not with that scenic life. McLaren, just there, it's like a fluorescent colour. We're passing it now anyway, let's go buddy. Oh, it's chrome! No, it's like a, like when the colour hits it's like different lighting and stuff. Awesome. Oh, there's a Ferrari just there, we passed one. Oh, there's the SUV, Rolls Royce and the Ferrari in front of it, oh my god. That's got to be an entourage of rappers, surely. That's got to be an entourage of rappers. That's what I love about America as well. Everyone's just decked to the nines. It's like a, a Saturday in the, I don't know, it's like 2 p.m. Is it 2 p.m.? Yeah, 3 p.m. They're just cruising around Rolls Royce SUVs and Ferraris, entourages. Maybach just there as well. I think that's Maybach. I don't know, it's like Maybach. <sighs> but they so much better in person. Oh my God. What a beast. What a beast. It's got to be a rapper. There's no way it's not a rapper. Think it'll be a rapper? Uh, I don't know. The old guy that is driving the Ferrari kind of looks like, you know, a producer or something. He's a producer? Something like that. Filmmaker? <laughs> <laughs> is that... I'm pretty sure it's just like producers and filmmakers out here, eh? Let's have a look. Oh, that sounds so Can't cool. see. Well, there's no way you're going to see inside this Rolls Royce. No, it's blacked out. Blacked out for sure. The brand new Phantom. <laughs> Oh my god. The license plate says Phantom. Oh my god, that is a boss car. It's like a million dollars. 1.2 million dollars. <laughs> is that the best car you've seen? So far, in America? yeah. 100%. Oh my god. That's DJ Khaled. It's gotta be DJ Khaled, right? <laughs> we the best! You won't hear me. my next car next upgrade I'm going Phantom what cars are you hoping to see um we've seen Aventador S for sure Bugatti Veyron Huayra what else is there I don't even know there's so many supercars Koenigseggs who knows what we'll see on Red Air Drive I have a feeling we'll see a lot of good cars I've already seen like what Phantom Urus another Rolls Royce Rolls Royce SUV like all the baller cars are here all the rapper entourage cars are here I just want to see what I can see personally and, and get some footage of because who doesn't love supercars? Let's be real here. Who doesn't fucking love supercars? In Australia, the cars just don't compare. So even in the car park right now, there's just a Bentley Bentayga. I mean, Bentley Bentayga, what the hell? Bentley Continental W12. It's a good start. It's a good start. But let's go check out what else is on Rodeo Drive. As soon as I walk out, there's a McLaren 720S. I mean, not 720S, well. 650s in like an awesome like personal color there's an aston i think vantage no that's a vanquish i think yeah well it's a vanquish and we've got blue row yellow lambo right there q8 just here this place is insane i can hear a jag revving his engine over here somewhere yeah there's a jag at pipe just there just everything is here. Just a bit of a closer look at the hurricane. Crazy. Oh, this is this is Roger Dubious, I believe. And then they've got Cullen in here as well. So crazy, crazy cars. Never seen both of these up close, but awesome to look at. Awesome.
walking around down Rodeo Drive, crazy amounts of cars, crazy amounts of nice, nice places. Love to visit these, love to visit these, love to look at what I can get, what I can't get, what I aspire to get, and obviously goals as well. So it's really nice here, really good weather. Look, I'm wearing like a, a long sleeve t-shirt and I'm not sweating. That's, that's an impressive thing for me. I've always sweat in Australia, but here the weather's like, I don't know what the weather's like, 26? 26, 27 degrees and I'm not sweating at all so really nice weather a really nice place if you want to come visit here as well highly recommend it if you love cars like me personally I'm always going to come to places like this because you see everything here <laughs> oh my Jesus I would be scared to walk around with this on my neck or my finger or my wrist what is this man like look at that oh my gosh those rocks are massive absolutely massive and here we arrive at literally goals this is like pure pure motivation right here all this stuff here is just crazy spiky spiky um, bracelets Rolex automatic gaze Tech for leaves, just everything in general is absolutely blinged out. Bust me down, boys, bust me down. AMG G63 GTS, another first, another first. Can't see anything else, but that, yeah. Oh, there's, there's another Phantom, I don't think that's even the same one. Yeah, it's not even the same one. <laughs> this place is insane, everywhere I look, I just see more and more cars every single time. Look at that for a beast. Oh my gosh. <laughs> How many Rolls Royce Phantoms can I see in one day, man? I, I'm struggling to keep up. Just everyone and their, everyone and their dad has a Ferrari here. So another Cullinan. I think there's an i8 over there. Seriously, all the baller cars are just out today. Every single baller car. Every single one. I feel like every colour I see is just a, it's got to be a rapper and entourage, I think. I don't believe it's just a casual person, but it looks fucking crazy from the outside, crazy. I'm going to rest, obviously been walking around for about an hour or so, um, just want to chill for a bit, went in from the cold, but I love exotic cars, I love expensive brands, so this is like a playground for me. May do a little bit of shopping, not too sure, but it's pretty close to our home anyway, so if I want to come back, I can. I've already had a look in Gucci and Chanel and stuff like that, Dior. I kind of like a couple of things. I want a shirt, I want a jumper, so I might buy a couple of things from Dior and then do like a big, big video about what I bought. But if I don't, I don't. I mean, it's it's the same, same. Honestly, it is the same, same here, especially Red Air Drive. I think it's even more expensive anyway than most of the other places, but I want to get something really decent that I can, I can really enjoy. But for now, I'm just going to relax, enjoy the view, obviously all the cars are amazing and I'll show you all of them as I go through them so once I've done that, yeah, we'll look at them all and I don't know, I want to see we get a Veyron so badly or a Huayra, any one of those two cars I'll be so happy with. That's sick. <laughs> what a baller. Look like part of Post Malone's crew to be honest and there's so many cars. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Rolls Royce Phantom, like, everywhere I look, there's just literally cars coming from everywhere. But that is one loud C63, man. One loud C63. Matte black, mad car, mad. I think a ghost. Let me know in the comments down below, but I don't know. I, I'm pretty bad with my pretty bad with my names of Rolls Royces to be honest. I know that's the four door, so I think it's a Wraith. I can't remember which one is the is the coupe, but oh my god, we have so much to look down here as well. I'm pretty sure if I just look down here already, I'll look down here and there'll be something. Oh, it's just a Rolls Royce and a and a Porsche. So going a bit off road out drive now, we're just having a walk on the other streets. There's a lot of other streets here, a lot of things to see. A lot of cars to see. I'm, I've said it before. Oh, okay, well hold on. There's a, there's that dude again, Post Malone's friend. 
Close but, um, yeah. So many cars here. I'm trying to keep up, even when I'm recording this. It's been, like, what, 20 seconds, and already a Rolls Royce has drove past me, so... We're gonna go for a bit of a wander, see what we can see, and hopefully I get to see a Wira or a Bugatti. Uh, GTC, I think it is, like the Roadsters. I think. Crazy matte black. Love that colour. Love that colour. Alright, last G-Wagon, unless there's like something really sick, but there is literally so many. I'm not even joking about them having a rule about owning G-Wagons in <laughs> LA. I feel like it's literally an essential thing. Oh, and there's a Rolls Royce. Oh, it's not a bad combo. <sighs> I try to jog slowly, but I missed out on seeing McLaren Senna. I can hear it in the in the far distance. I'm so mad. You'd never get those in Australia. I think there's like four in Australia in total. So <sighs> hopefully it does a UE. <laughs> hopefully it chucks a UE, but we'll keep walking, we'll keep exploring. Hopefully I get to see it again. Oh, this thing sounds amazing. It's funny because like I look at an M4, I'm like it's Rolls Royces and Lambos everywhere. I don't care about a fucking M4. <laughs> Look at that. The Mercedes, I oh know, it was a Lexus on bags. The G Wagon. The oh, McLaren's still here. G Wagon just behind it, and I think there's a Rolls Royce too somewhere here. Yeah, so. McLaren, G Wagon, and a Rolls Royce. And then we got Quavo. Quavo in the G Wagon. Quavo in the G-Wagon, holy fuck. I've always loved Fluoro cars, that's, I think it's a 4x4 squared as well. Yeah, it's a 4x4 squared. There's a Lambo over there, Eurus over here. Where do I, where do I end? Where do I end this vlog? Because there's so many cars to see. And like, I can never get enough of Lambos, let's be real here. If anyone can, it's very impressive, but, oh, and I see an Aventador as well. Oh my God, so many cars, so many. You can see the Eurus. Oh, crazy. Hey. <laughs> so out the front of Louis, there's a, um, there's a hurricane here too. There's just, there's just supercars everywhere. I'm struggling, I'm struggling to keep track of how many I've seen, but I want to rent one, I want to come down here, it will be fine. I think it will be an awesome video, but I don't know, I don't know, just to rent a Lambo just to come down here probably not worth it but we've got to do it at some point and there's a blue SV oh is it SV? no I think it's just a anniversary but Whoa. crazy looks so nice in that I think it's like marina blue marina blue as well there's a hurricane I just saw before I think it was parked at Louis we just did a few, a few bits of shopping, you know, the essential stuff, got to get some apples, some bananas, maybe a Louis bag or two, but... <laughs> it's a bit of jazz, it's a bit of jazz on the bike. So we're done on Rodeo, we are, um, we're probably going to head off to Malibu, I think, or we're we heading home? We are going for a scenic drive. We're going for a scenic it's drive. It's a surprise. Yeah. yeah, we're going for a scenic drive, it's a surprise. <laughs> Part I didn't even know it, I guess. Uh, you're gonna have to turn left in a second. Okay, well, that's good. Yep, yep, left. just up. Yeah, we went past it, but that's okay, okay. got here. This Bentley needs to hurry up, I guess. Yep, cool, thanks, I guess. No left or U turn. Okay, we're well, not turning there <laughs> either. Okay, so the um, surprise was you're gonna fuck me around. <laughs> get in the right lane, get okay, in the right lane. Okay, we're gonna swerve over here now. Probably kill someone in the process of getting out of here, but hey. So, point three. Point two of a mile. This way? No, point. I'm not turning here. Okay. No, point two of a mile. You're turning right onto Trenton Drive. Okay. Okay. As I was saying, it's a surprise. I guess I'm gonna get out of here. Hopefully, I will um, end up surviving. But there is a guy at my asshole. I'm getting pretty mad. But we're gonna go on a scenic drive. It's gonna be good. I hope. There's an I8 there. There's everything everywhere. Can't even keep up. This place is so fast moving. Just the way I like it, to be honest. I, I, I like this place. I like this place a lot. So just arrived. So the scenic, obviously, the scenic drive that we've gone on. I have no idea where we are, but as you can see in the background, kind of, not really. We're pretty much at a, a huge lookout point. There's a lot to see on top of this mountain that we're about to walk up. It's 
really, really lovely. It's like really nice weather. It's like perfect, perfect weather. It was shitty this morning. I remember waking up, saw, saw it was cloudy. I'm just like, oh man, it's gonna suck filming on Rodeo with cloudy weather, but it's actually been pretty good, really, really good weather. So I changed shoes, as you can see, I've got, got the sketches on right now. Gotta make sure I don't scuff up the shoes that I literally just bought, but I have. I have, flashing. There it is, okay. So yeah, walking up here, I need to walk. I feel so unfit, had too much shit to eat. Speaking of shit to eat, we're probably gonna get more food after this as well, so. A lot of day of food, but I don't know, if you come here once, you have to go to the places that you love, or else it's just shit. Like, if you come here and you worry about all the money that you spend, you're not gonna do jack shit here, so. We're gonna look up here. I'll give you a view of the of the overlook, but I still feel so unfit. Like I'm I'm breathing heavily right now. It's pretty it's pretty gross. So walking on the trail, bailed. I'm not gonna walk two kilometers when I'm I feel so unfit. I'm not gonna do it. But there's a couple of views here we've looked at. Looks really nice. Looks really nice. But couldn't really vlog it like you can't really see much on this camera to be honest when you're when you're vlogging a lot of stuff in like the landscape when it's really far away so i'm gonna head back to the car now probably head to the hotel and get some food because i'm starving so i just realized that i didn't actually do an outro at all i don't know i got home and i was really fucking tired so just laid down for a bit and stuff like that but that was it for today obviously we went to rodeo drive and that was awesome seeing all those cars was amazing going to that point we didn't really go to the top of the point but we still got a bit of view sorry i didn't film any of it it's really hard to see on this camera when you're trying to film like very far out so i didn't film any of that but it was a really good day i'm really tired now so i'm gonna sign off here but thank you for watching and i will see you next video gvn play that back boy